Hello there everyone. Today is Tuesday, November 27th, 2012. Current time right now is 1.42 p.m. and the snow is still falling out there. Um, snow started this morning a little bit heavy and then it kind of lightened up a little bit and now got a little bit heavier again a little bit later and now it's falling lightly once again. So the snow has varied in intensities throughout the day today and is still falling and is still expected to fall. Um, kind of just throughout the rest of the day today into this evening. However, accumulations as you can see are not that impressive. Um, not even an inch outside the mass weather studio here. Um, and is not really doing the greatest job covering roadways. Um, there are a lot of schools though in the area that did go through with early dismissals today just as a precaution. Um, as the snow is still falling now and as it gets a little bit colder a little bit later it is possible for the snow to start to accumulate a little bit on the roads and as far as also uh, when it gets colder overnight tonight um, black ice is something to be concerned about as well um, although as far as snowfall accumulation goes there's not that much you can see um, right across the way there you can still see some of the grass underneath the snow and you can still see some of the grass poking through the snow here so you can see the footprints out there not very deep snow Okay, and now here's some here's an update on the current forecast for this storm. So basically, this storm is going to continue on through the rest of the day today into this evening. Basically, like it's been going on so far today. You know, with the on and off snow showers, uh, a little bit heavier as we get a little bit later into the afternoon. But the good thing about the storm, like I did just say when we were taking a look outside a minute ago, uh, snowfall accumulations are not expected to be that much. Uh, when the storm is said and done. So that's always good. So that way there won't be that much of a mess to wake up to tomorrow morning. Um, however though, black ice is always a concern in these type of situations. Um, okay, so let's talk about what's going on with the storm right now. Snow began falling across parts of Connecticut on Tuesday morning in advance of a system that could drop two to three inches of snow in some spots. Early warning weather meteorologist Scott Haney said light snow will break out across the state by mid-morning as the area of low pressure moves into the mid-Atlantic. The shoreline might be just warm enough to start off as a rain slash snow mix or possibly even just plain rain, Haney said. As the coastal storms move further east and passes Connecticut, it will start to intensify. This intensification may warrant a change to all snow even at the shoreline as colder air starts to filter in on the backside of the storm. This increase in, of intensity may allow a period of moderate snow to move over, the, over southern sections of the state, Haney said. Inland sections of southern Connecticut will get the highest accumulations with totals, totals ranging up to 3 inches. And there may even be an isolated place of 4 inches, especially in parts of northern Fairfield County. As you drive closer to the shore, accumulations will lessen due to rain mixing in at times. As you go north of central Connecticut, accumulations will also be less as you travel further away from the storm. As for high temperatures, Haney said they, that will be happening right as the snow starts to fall. Highs will reach into the mid to upper 30s inland and reach around 40 at the shore. By early afternoon, temperatures will be falling, so the morning will be the warmest part of the day. So um, I want to go over the, the, uh, a weather, some weather alerts that are in effect for this storm right now. A special weather statement is in effect for Hartford, Tolland, and Wyndham counties. And that special weather statement is this. A light accumulation of snow may cause travel problems for this afternoon's commute as well as black icing later tonight. So, um, like I said, you know, they may issue, like I said yesterday, they may issue some type of a minimal weather alert to go along with this storm, which they did. So, this is not that much of a storm, but it is causing a little bit of a mess out on the roads, a little bit of a mess out there right now, just making it a little slick right now. Not too, too bad though at all. Um, okay, now let's go over the forecast for the rest of this storm. Um, Today, cloudy with light snow developing by mid-morning, which happened right on cue. A short period of moderate snow is possible in the afternoon. Snow will taper off in the evening. Accumulations between a trace to three inches. High of 37 degrees inland, 39 of the shore today. Um, looking at Doppler radar right now, it looks like that a that little bit of a heavier band of snow is kind of starting to make its way into southern Fairfield County right now and is starting to kind of churn its way into the state. So we may see a little bit of a heavier burst of snow showers um, as we get a little bit later in the afternoon like I said before. Um, but still, accumulations will not be that much, not really that big of a deal. Uh, this evening, gradual clearing, some flurries lingering. Lows this evening ranging between 24 and 31 degrees. And then tomorrow, Wednesday, November 27th, becoming partly sunny, windy and cold. High 38 degrees inland, 39 at the shore. So that's basically that's basically it. That's basically the story with this storm. Um,
that'll be it for now. If anything changes with the storm that warrants another update video a little bit later tonight, I will certainly do that. But otherwise, we'll see you tomorrow on Wednesday, November 27th, or excuse me, on Wednesday, November 28th tomorrow for the Matt's Weather Weekly Weather News. We'll see you then.